Gravity's pulling this plane towards the ground. So why doesn't it fall out of the sky? There must be a counter force pushing upwards. This upward force is called lift. Even a jumbo jet weighing over 300 tons can create enough lift to get off the ground. So how does it work? You can create lift by blowing over the top of a piece of paper. Air particles are bumping into the paper from all sides. These create forces. If the paper isn't moving, the air forces above and below must be balanced. Blowing pushes the air particles over the top of the paper, so fewer particles hit it from above. The downward force is momentarily smaller than the upward force, so the paper rises. For a wing to work, it needs to be able to create lift. So what shape does it need to be? With an asymmetrical wing, the airflow over the top is different than the airflow underneath. The air has to travel further over the top than it does underneath. If it has to travel further in the same amount of time, the air over the top must be traveling faster. We know from our piece of paper that making the airflow faster over the top reduces the downward force. The downward force is smaller than the upward force, so the wing lifts. When a plane goes fast enough, the wings create enough lift for it to take off. <laughs> 